guess what? I am playing the 3K today. I don't know if you guys have been watching my previous videos to the end. For the last like three nights in a row said, yeah, I might take tomorrow off, might not play. I lie, I lie. I woke up today, I was tired, I was, and took a nap, and now I feel like a new woman, and there's no chance I'm missing this 3K. It's such a good one. It's a four-day tournament, and I am very late. <laughs> it started at 11, and it's now five o'clock. They're about to go on dinner break, so my plan is to get back in time, you know, start by the time everyone gets back from dinner break. If I register then, then I start the tournament with 50 big blinds. Totally enough to work with, and I feel good, I feel like, I'm gonna be refreshed when everyone's just gonna be like lethargic and tired and full bellied from dinner. So if you guys don't know who I am, uh, I'm Lexi Gavin, professional poker player and coach, and I am vlogging every single day of the World Series of Poker for the next seven weeks, or at least every day that I'm playing, which is almost every day. So hit that subscribe, like, follow, come follow the journey uh, with me as hopefully I win my first bracelet in the World Series of Poker. Okay, let's go. Idiot, so before the tournament to get your greens in. That's amazing. All right, so I guess the higher buy-in tournaments, most of them play on the Paris side, which is nice. Uh, so this is a 3K, $3,000 buy-in, and we're playing in luxury today, ladies and gentlemen. Let's go. Voting for Norm Lawn, you know, I golfed with him. Nice guy, but obviously carrying the water. Uh, you know, I'm, gonna, I'm definitely going to go to Dino. And that's savage. I'm saying all the ones that he said. Dino is an unbelievable player. All right. Just hopped in. 40,000 chips. We got Dan Shock here. Good guy, good guy. Mark Ioli. <laughs> <laughs> For the lunch. And yeah, it'll be fun. I love that I'm in Paris. Wow. Nice switch up. First break, I am down to 22k. You start with 40k. Um, I just lost this hand right before break. Under the gun, limps. It folds around to me in a small blind. I have ace, seven of spades. I call. Uh, I complete the small blind and the big blind checks. The flop is ace, five, three, one spade. I have ace, seven of spades. I check. The under the gun player uh, bets small. Bets like 2k. I call. The turn is another five. Um, I check and he checks back. The river is a queen. So I bet 4K and he thinks for a bit and then calls. The river is the queen of diamonds. So I wanna bet again here, uh, hoping to um, get thin value from a queen or like pocket, like a small pocket pair or something. So I bet 4K and he raises to 12K and I, Fold and he shows That's king ten of diamonds. Craig Chi, Frank Casella, Legends, and I'm sorry, I do know you, but I forgot your name. That's all right. Uh, Jimmy Dempsey. Can we just, can we just cancel that? Jimmy Dempsey. There we go. There we go. That's right. That's right. That's right. That's right. That's right. That's right. Nobody knows you. Hey, Craig. I got my yes. wedding invitation. What, what is my intro? Do me. Hey guys, Lexi Gavin here. <laughs> Hope you all having a great day. <laughs> just wanted to let you know that I played the 3K No Limit today. <laughs> Wow. Keep you posted. <laughs> you know what? I, I hate how I kind of like I'm that. Yeah, I kinda, I'm kind of liking that. That was good. <laughs> that was good. Like that, was a, yeah. that was scarily close. All right. Bye. That's all. That's all for now. Bye. <laughs> good luck, Alan. Good luck. <laughs> all right. Okay. You got it, Alan. We're gonna sweat this. It's not even the same tournament that we're playing, but ace let's sweat it for him. So this is ace to five triple draw. Alan, how are you feeling about your hand? 
Thank you. I was all in for, for crumbs. All in for crumbs. Oh! And the crowd goes wild. Oh. <laughs> I was on the live stream. Oh, I was like man. the final game. I was four uh, You got the bowls. Okay. My first all in. First all in. Yeah, no, it's not a series. <laughs> <laughs> has done it. With a deuce on the river, Blumstein has secured the win in the 2017 WSOP main event. We go way, way back, back from the East Coast days where we both were drivers, oh, yeah. right? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. So, Scott, why don't you tell me what the first small stakes tournament you ever played was? Well, yeah, I mean, you know, I started 18 years old going up to Turning Stone Resort Casino in Syracuse, outside of Syracuse, New York, playing, you know, what, you know, a couple hundred dollar buy, whatever they had, and Taking my uh, my my, uh, my my birthday checks from my grandma and going to play uh, you know a couple hundred dollar tournaments <laughs> and then uh, you know the occasional parks daily when I'm in college and and uh, you know once you turn 21 then you can start to play you don't have to drive five hours anymore to go play so yeah you know I I, I definitely got my start in the small stakes MTTs and I uh, remember those days fondly so. So what advice would you give someone who's just starting to play small stakes tournaments? You know, honestly, just, it's so tough. I mean, if you're just starting out, just, it's so funny because it, it took me a long time before I really figured it out, right? So I guess the best advice I can give is don't be too hard on yourself, you know? Like, it's if it's early in your career, just try to get better every time you play, you know? I mean, like... If, if, if at least try and understand if you're making uh, the good, you know, good decisions and have fun. Most importantly, have fun. Right, early in your career, you can you can save the misery for when you're really yeah. grinding. So, I love that. so yeah, just uh, have fun and, and uh, yeah, it's poker. It's a great game. And, awesome. and, and last question. This doesn't have to do with small stakes tournaments, but how can you describe the feeling of winning the World Series Poker Main Event? Because I'm sure it's a dream and a goal of all of us. I literally dream about winning the main event. And you actually won it. Uh, it's pretty cool. It's pretty cool, for sure. Uh, definitely, like, a great experience. I would recommend everyone try it. Um, you know, it was unexpected, right? That's the thing. That's the best thing I could say. It's like, you know, it wasn't, you know, we, we grinded together, right? We, you know, so any, I, I, I like to just be the poster child and anyone can do it, you know? So if you're out there grinding small stakes tournaments in five years, you might do it too. So that's awesome. the moral of the story. Well, congratulations again. And this is the five year anniversary of his win. So maybe you'll have another deep run in the main. And I hope you do. Uh, it's exactly right. That's what I'm, gonna, that's what I'm here to do. Awesome. So we'll see. Thank you, Scott. Thanks, Lexi. All right. All right, y'all, so that wraps up today's video. Thanks for sticking around. Uh, I am gonna play the 1K. I did find out it's a 1K freeze out, and
and it's 40 minute level, so not quite a turbo. So I'm looking forward to playing that one. I am gonna start pretty much on time. Um, and yeah, that should be a fun one. So thanks again for watching. Hit that subscribe to follow the rest of my World Series of Poker journey. And I appreciate and love you all. Best of luck in your games if you're out here. Good luck to you in the series. And yeah, I will see you guys tomorrow for the 1K.